I'm here doing my usual morning walk with Floss. I just had a really weird, weird sensation. And it was like I suddenly realised that I was a... No, hold on. How should I put this? I was a bundle of particles, energy, whatever you want to call it, moving through a different medium, but not separate. Oh, it's hard to describe. I think it was I lost my boundary so that I wasn't this separate entity. I was just a different vibrational pattern moving through another vibrational pattern. And I stood still and closed my eyes. And behind my eyelids, it was <laughs> as though there were thousands of little tiny dots, all very ordered, quietly moving into a central spot. So sort of filtering from the outside in and down into this spot, into this, this um, point in the middle. It was just weird. Um, and then the analogy of um, Haramine's plug hole came to me where, you know, his, his sort of way to try and explain how um, physical structures come about is by the gravitational field organising the energy of the field, of the, the unified field, the zero point field so that the movement of the energy is no longer random. It becomes organised and that forms the physical reality, the physical stuff we see. I don't know. It was just a really weird sensation that I've still got now, a sort of tingling on the outside as though... as though I'm feeling my lack of boundary. There you go. Maybe that's what it is. So instead of it all just being in my head about I understand the concept uh, that we have no boundary, instead, I'm actually feeling it. And I am, at the moment, really into the senses, you know, studying and how we describe ourselves in the physical world and how that can separate us from the physical world, you know, from, from the unity of the physical world as well as from the energy. So maybe, <laughs> maybe the universe just try, tried to send me something that helped me make sense of it. I don't know. Anyway, wishing you all a beautiful day, as you can see here. It's absolutely glorious. It's about, I don't know, quarter past seven in the morning. Flossie and I are on our usual morning perambulation needless to say I can't find Flossie because she's off chasing something so um, all is well with the world so sending you love and hugs and speak to you soon <laughs>